Got the Cowboys behind them with 16 to 1 odds. I mean, they haven't been to a Super Bowl since 1995. I feel like, okay, they make it to the playoffs and then they lose a the game and then they're out immediately. Uh, for those Cowboys fans watching, what do you think, Todd? 16 to 1 for the Cowboys. I mean, this would be one of the logical choices. You keep waiting for them to make the ascent in the NFC that's more wide open going into the 2022 season than ever before, given the defections of a lot of veteran quarterbacks especially through the NFC South. Brady talked about Aaron Rodgers' uncertain status in Green Bay. If Dallas can't step up now, then when, you have to ask yourself. You have the pieces on the offensive side of the ball with your franchise quarterback and Dak Prescott. The running back situation remains muddled. I still think Tony Pollard gives them more explosion than Ezekiel Elliott at this point in his career. But we're going to have to see how the receiver position ends up working itself out. Cedric Wilson, a free agent, all sorts of talk about Amari Cooper that could have potentially played his last game as a member of the Cowboys, which will force CeeDee Lamb to step into that number one role, something he's more than capable of doing. But you look at Dallas on the defensive side as well, and I think one of their top concerns needs to be addressing that pass rush. Randy Gregory will be a free agent as well. And we saw this group overachieve for stretches. They have a bona fide star in the middle in Micah Parsons they can build around, and they play in a division where they should be prohibitive favorites for years to come. But until we see Dallas get over that hump, can you really advocate for betting them as one of these favorites in the NFC. I can't do it with Mike McCarthy at the helm. I think they're the class of the NFC East, but that may still be their ceiling at this point. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.